I'm good. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Uh, firstly, I want to thank you for uh, accepting my invitation and uh, uh, allowing me to talk with you. Great, thank you for inviting me. Yeah, and uh, one of uh, one of uh, one person said me to contact you and uh, uh, with whom I did already a video in, and I just uploaded in my YouTube channel and I got uh, good uh, uploads. I mean, I got very positive response for the video I did and uh, that he said that uh, you are a great person. You you are a good speaker and you 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 are the best person with whom uh, um, I mean he said me that. Uh, um, uh, there is a person who can talk uh, great and you know who's a good speaker just go and just try to contact her if she accepts your invitation you know that will be good for you so i Thank just you contacted you <laughs> and <laughs> i contacted <laughs> i contacted you and luckily you accepted my invitation thank you so much no problems at all so what would you like to talk about uh, actually i want to introduce you you to my audience and i want to uh, show my audience about uh, what uh, you do in your life yep okay that sounds like a good idea yeah so can you introduce yourself to my audience who are watching this video i certainly can so my name is lisa kelly um i live in mandra western australia um as you'll see, I'm dressed up as Where's Wally. So this isn't how I always dress, but I just find by dressing as Where's Wally, it connects with people because I don't know, are you familiar with Where's Wally? Do you know the Where's Wally books at all? Are you familiar with them? I I have a, a small uh, knowledge about it, but I don't have uh, much. Uh, about? Yeah. Okay, so for those who don't know, the Where's Wally is a book where you have to find a character that's dressed like me with a, okay. well, I don't know if you can see me, I'll stand up, with a red and white striped shirt. And can you see that? Can yeah, yeah, yeah. That? There we are. Yeah, well, he's yeah. like this. If I put him in, in front, so he, dre oh, if I can work out how he is. There we are. So that's like a little Where's Wally character there. So I started dressing up as Where's Wally to connect with people. Um, my husband is the, uh, was the president of the Master Plumbers Association, and he used to go around and take photos on Facebook and put them up, and one of his friends said, you like Where's Wally? head pops up everywhere so I thought well I'll get him an outfit and then it looked like a lot of fun so I got me an outfit and then I've started connecting with people because people know this character so they'll say where's Wally and what are you up to so then it'll just start conversation and then I decided that I could do something good with it and so now I go around promoting local businesses and um, events that are coming up and just do it in a fun way so it's a little bit different. Okay so this yeah. character this character is in a book. Yes, so it's called Where's Wally. There's a book. If you go to the library or a bookstore or anything like that, I don't know if you're allowed to with COVID at the moment, but if you find it or if you just Google Where's Wally, you'll be able to find out. And in some countries, he's called Waldo, like I think in America and um, Europe, they class him as Waldo, but in Australia, we call him Where's Wally. Where's Wally? Where's Wally, yep. So, yeah. Where's Wally? Okay. So who is the author of that book? Oh, good question. Oh, I have to find his book. Isn't that that's really bad? I take his character on, but I can't think what his name is. There we are. That's something for your viewers to do. They can go on and find out who the author is. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll have to find out myself for my next interview. Okay. So why I'll definitely ask you in the next interview about uh, the author and I'll ask more questions about it. But now I want you to tell about why you dressed up like this and why what is what is your intention uh, to dress up like this okay so my intention my main intention is to make people happy so whenever i see people when i'm walking down the street and they'll say oh where's wally and they'll just have a smile on their face because most of the people who see me obviously know the character so that's why they would say it and then it like sparks a conversation with people so I often say it connects the disconnected society. So when I'm walking down the street, you know, for example, if I walk down the street past you and I wouldn't know you, but if you knew my character of Where's Wally, you might say to me, oh, where's Wally? And then that sparks a conversation. So then I have made friends through my Where's Wally dressing up. And I've had people, like one example, um, young girls over in Sydney, when I went over dressed as Wally in Sydney, came running over to me and said, We've been looking for you for 17 years and we finally found you. So they've obviously been brought up with a Where's Wally in their home. 
So um, then for them to see the character in real life where you know, I'm not the real character, but I dress in character. So that's, um, yeah, so that's the sort of things that I've um, come across. And, and it's, yeah, so my main aim is to connect a disconnected society and make people smile. Awesome. I, I, I think uh, you're the first person who is different in, uh, you know, if I compare all the people with whom I did videos before, you're, you're yeah. completely different. Yeah, so I'm a, I'm a bit out there. Like, most people kind of go, oh, why do you do crazy stuff like that? And I say, well, it puts a smile on people's face. That's what it's all about. I think in this world, too many people worry what people think of them. And I'm not one of those. I often say, it's none of our business what other people think of us. As long as you know you're doing good and you're making people smile, don't worry what other people think about you. And also I find um, in this world, when a minority don't like something, people will stop doing it. The majority will possibly like it, but because a minority say, oh, you shouldn't be doing that, they'll stop doing it. Well, I'm the opposite. I don't stop because people don't like it. I just say to him, because I have my Facebook page, which if your viewers want to know, it's Wally Fun with Lisa, all in one line, of all joined together. Um, I just say to him, if you don't like it, scroll past. You don't have to look at what I'm doing. You've got the... I've got other people that love it and they message me and say I was having a really crappy day and you put a smile on my face. So that's what, why I keep doing it. Okay. So what 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 is what what this character do in the in that book? What is what in is that the book? book? So yeah. um right, in the book what it is is it's a really busy place. So I can imagine because you're living in India, I'm guessing. Are yeah, you yeah. in India? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So in Delhi, is that your capital city? Yeah. Yep. And what's your population over there? What's the population of Delhi? Delhi, I don't have idea. Delhi population. Oh, well, you better do some research, <laughs> haven't you? <laughs> I'll do that after this video. <laughs> you got to do some research. Anyway, so let's say, for example, the population of Delhi is 10 million people, which it probably isn't, but 10 million people. So, and you'd see all different kinds of people. There'd be people dressed in colours. There'd be people dressed like you. And then... Along comes Where's Wally in the middle of all those people. And then once someone takes a photo from the sky down, in that book, people have to try and find Wally in all those people. So that's what the Where's Wally book's about. You have to go. It's like a little jigsaw. You have to look and really concentrate and have a look and try and find this character in the middle of 10,000 people. So if, okay. you ever, yeah, if you ever look for a Where's Wally book, you'll see it's a really busy page and you have to find the red and white character. And then they have other things you've got to find, like a little dog or a baker or something like that. So that's what it is. So it's primarily a kid's book, um, but adults do it as well. Okay. Uh, at least uh, tell me uh, the author, where, where is he's from? I believe it started in, in America, as far as I know. Um, okay. Yeah, so um, I can't definitely say that. He's probably from India. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> he could be from India. <laughs> I'll have to do a bit of research on that. <laughs> so, uh, when you when you when you read this book for the first time? Yeah. When did I read it? Um, oh, when I was a little, like when I was young, like probably ten or something. I probably got it out of the library. So now I'm 53. That was 40 yeah. years ago. <laughs> So I'm old. Years. You're probably only young. How old are you? You look really young. <laughs> How much do well, you, you think? Uh, you only look like you're in your 20s, I reckon. Yeah, I'm 27. Yeah, okay. Oh, you're looking pretty good for your age. You got a girlfriend <laughs> or a wife or yeah, anything? Yeah, I have a girlfriend and who is watching this video right now. Uh, oh, is she? Yeah, Where is I mean, she? Put her in. I want to say hello to her. <laughs> no, no. After putting this video on YouTube, she will see this video for sure. And she will know that uh, there is a person who is who dressed up like West Valley and they, she will start researching about uh, the, yeah, the try character. Yeah, have a look at... Yeah, at West Valley and have a look and, and see if you can... You can sit down and have a romantic dinner tonight and look for Where's Wally. How about that? <laughs> and she, she's listening this and definitely maybe she... If she watches this, definitely she'll ask me. Yeah, yeah, all about Waze Wally, yeah. So why only Waze Wally? Why, why not other characters in other books? Well, it, it kind of started because of that um, friend of my husband who said oh. that his face was like Waze Wally popping up. So that's why I got him the outfit. 
And then I was going on holidays with him and I thought, well, I'll get an outfit for me. And then so we both did it and then he didn't want to do it anymore and I kept on doing it. So I just love doing it because it brings me lots of fun and I meet lots of different people like I'm meeting you now, which I wouldn't have met before because of my (laughs) Wings Molly character. So that's what I do. Yeah, yeah, you are telling uh, uh, people who don't know about Waste Valley. Definitely, after yeah. watching this video, people will know. And I want to know, uh, only the, is this book and this character is only for kids or uh, for all the age no, groups? No, adults. Adults, because, yeah, like I think what happens is um, a parent may get the Where's Wally book for their kids, but okay. then you kind of get get a bit addicted to it because then you're helping them find it and the books are you know i could run and get one i've got a book here i could run and get one and show you but you should i go and get one quickly yeah sure should yeah. i quickly go, go okay i'll go and get one won't you Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Okay, so his name is Martin Handford. Can you see that? Yeah, Martin Handford. Yeah. yeah, that's him there. And so the books, I'll get one. So I've got a heap of books there. There's lots of books there. So this one's called Wally the Wonder Book. So that's what it's like. See how busy it is? Yeah, yeah. So you have to go and try and find Wally. Wally in that, okay. that book so and what happens I think parents would sit with their kids and okay. be finding it and then the kids would go to sleep and then the parents would carry on looking for it so it can be for kids or it can be for adults but I get most of the response I get from adults more than kids okay because obviously adults have grown up with the book as well so yeah so, that's so what fun. so what people should learn from this book what is there in this book um, well, I guess it's just a, a really good book for patients to actually have the patience to try and find Wally. I think it would be good for the brain, you know, because you're having to act actively. So if anyone's got dementia or something like that, and it's a good time passer. So if you're locked up in your house with COVID, get some Where's Wally books, that'll pass your time by because it gives you um, things of what you have to find. You know, there's a a list of things you have to find in each picture. I don't know if you can see that properly, but it gives you a checklist and then you have to go through and find all those different things. So that's a good COVID. If you're okay. looking for something to pass your day by, get Wally books. So that's okay. it. So, so how is how is yeah. COVID with you over in India? COVID is ruling here. Still, uh, the cases are increasing and uh, I think... Uh, human is unable to control it and he's trying to control here yeah 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 well where i am i don't know if you know much about australia so in western australia do you know where western australia is yeah in yeah. Australia? yeah yeah. I know. yeah so we've got our borders shut off from the rest of australia and okay. we haven't had a community active active case since the 12th of april okay so we're trying to stop the borders being open but the east coast and the Prime Minister and are trying to open the borders, but we're pushing back saying, no, we don't want it because otherwise we're going to get cases over here. So we're fighting to keep our, our, our state closed from the rest of Australia. So I have actually interviewed Mark McGowan, the Premier, dressed as Where's Wally, and okay. told him, don't be a Wally and open the borders. And he hasn't opened them yet, so I'm hoping they don't open the borders. But I okay. feel for countries like yours that are suffering with COVID, we're allowed to go out we're allowed to go to hotels we're allowed to go out and do whatever we want to really now um but the rest of the world's not as lucky as us yeah so yeah very sad yeah that's i mean nobody knows this information about western australia no no that's right we are in the lucky we're in the lucky state I, i say we're in the luckiest place in the whole wide world how many cases has been uh, uh, registered in your well, area? Well, I in in um my in in Western Australia itself, we have only had about 80 
active cases and they are all people in quarantine. So that's people that have flown in from other countries or from other states of Australia. We haven't had any community community or uh, community-based ones transmitted. So it's only been people flying in from other countries that we've had. So, But over in Victoria now, which is the other side of Australia, they've had to shut right down now because they've, they're getting like about 800 active cases a day. And I'm not sure how many deaths, but nothing compared to other, uh, other countries. But if they don't get it under control, it will get worse and worse. So, But we don't have the population like what – like our, our, our population, population of the whole of Australia is only 31 million. I don't know yeah, what it yeah. is in, in India. That's probably yeah. just one city. I don't know. Um, yeah, a lot less people over here, but still very sad. Even in India, a lot of people got affected. I don't know the exact number. Uh, Indian population is 130 crores. I think in my state, in which I'm staying, you know, there, there are 10 crores. 10 crores people are uh, living in my state. I think yep. uh, your population is equal to three or four states in uh, of of Indian population. Yes, exactly. So, are you quarantined? Then, are you allowed to go out, or you've got to stay home? Yeah, I, I mean, government said that uh, you have to take care of yourself. We are opening everything, and we are, uh, you know, government uh, opened everything, including gyms, including uh, right, okay. hotels. You know, everything is open. You know, recently yeah, okay. the government issued a. Uh, 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 a message and saying that uh, everything is open and it is your own responsibility. You have to wear your own mask and you have to wear your, uh, you have to take the sanitizer, you have to sanitize yeah. yourself. And uh, every shop or every store in every, you know, everything in a, uh, every selling, uh, uh, every store. selling things, uh, early stores, everything, you know, they have to sanitize. Every person should be sanitized uh, before they enter into the store. Yeah, so, okay. And you just so, hope people follow those instructions because yeah. there's people out there that don't, and then that causes the dramas, obviously. Yeah. So do you have do you have any idea about the medicine that which kills uh, COVID nineteen? No. Well, I know, I know. I did see a video the other day from America, okay. and um, is that someone beeping at me to say hello? Hi. Hi. I just heard the beeping. <laughs> sorry, just being funny. Um, <laughs> I'm just a bit of a comedian. It made you smile a little bit. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I thought they were saying hi to me. I thought they found Molly. Um, <laughs> um, I did see a video the other day from America, and it was an American um, doctor who was on there who said there was this stuff called hydrochlor or something or other or other. But I tried to... Sh- it on my Facebook page, but it was shut down by Facebook because they said it wasn't actually um, wasn't proven that it it would work. So I don't know whether it does or not. She apparently had treated 350 people with COVID and they had all recovered. So I don't know whether it's true or not. So yeah, I think it might be a while before they actually get a vaccine because um, there's so many strains of the COVID virus now, which is causing dramas. So. Yeah, very, very, very scary. And I guess over there it's – oh, they, they found me again. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, I don't <laughs> – they're getting really excited down there. Um, I don't know if it, like in India, whether it's a lot of the elderly passing away. That's a, the majority of them over here are elderly people that are passing away with COVID. Okay. So let's talk yeah. about something which is positive. Let's talk about... Yeah, your let's talk about... That. Yes, let's do that. <laughs> let's, let's talk about uh, uh, your character that you choose. And uh, I, I want to know why you... Why, why, uh, is that is this character is only about fun or uh, all other emotions? Um, mainly fun. Mainly okay. fun. Okay. Um, yeah, because I'm not one that wants to... As you said, you want to be uplifting and positive. You don't want to be... And there's so much doom and gloom in the world. So mine is really just to be fun and do crazy stuff and, and um, yeah, just put smiles on people's faces. That's my main aim. Is um, I often say if anyone's if anyone's suffering with depression, get a Where's Wally outfit, go and sit okay. in the street and someone will talk to you and it'll lift okay. you. It'll be uplifting, that's what I say. Yeah. So, or, or else they yeah. should meet you or they should see 
uh, any videos of you or any uh, posts of you so that uh, you can make them uh, smile or else yeah, they exactly. should meet you yeah yeah yeah, that's right. And and when uh, my husband and I walk down the street, um, you know, in our hometown or home city, um, people will say, oh, you've left Wally at home. And I go, yeah, yeah, I gave him a night off tonight. And then we walk past and I say, I've got no idea who that person is. You know, like, so people know me now through okay. my Where's Wally that they know me, but I don't know them, which is nice. Like, I'm a little bit famous, I'm guessing. So you are saying that this is a 40 years old book. Do you, uh, how can people... In this generation can connect with that book. I, I see. I'm I'm 27 years old. I'm listening the, this name uh, for the first time. I, uh, I well I'm, when yeah. when you you and your girlfriend get married and you have children, go out and buy a Where's Wally book because you've probably be able to buy it over in India. I'm thinking, and okay. then you can learn to love the Where's Wally character like I have. You know, like I'm not sure how big it is in in India over here. Most people know in Australia. Most people know it. Um, okay. So it's just an education thing. But over in shops here, bookshops, people can just buy it off the shelf. Libraries, they normally have them in the library. Um, yeah, so I'm guessing it's what you're brought up with as well. You know, if, you're, if your parents are into reading, they might have one in the book, in, the, in their house or whatever. Um, but yeah, you would be able to, you should be able to get it in India, I would reckon. Almost definitely, probably. definitely. I'll recommend this book uh, to everybody who is born. Who, who are my subscribers because uh, you are you are telling that this is connected with fun and everybody every human being needs fun and yeah exactly <laughs> yeah the world goes around with fun you know yeah. La- after is the best medicine so and you made me down, you made me yeah you made me uh, smile for twice you know <laughs> that exactly. is fantastic exactly is good. so there's another thing i'll tell you what else i do i do this as me sometimes i've done it as where's wally but as me i take it I go to a lot of concerts. Do you ever go to concerts? Do you like concerts? You yeah, know, people like, singing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I go to a lot of concerts and I get friends to go to concerts with me. And I take a speaker. So I've got a Bose speaker. So I download the music through Spotify. Do you have Spotify over in India? Spotify? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, I download the music on Spotify of who's ever concert I've just been to. And then... I play that music on the train on the way home and get people dancing on the train. Okay. So, again, I connect a disconnected society. So, I get to meet people who've been to the concert and we just get on the train and dance and sing and all the way home. So, that's another thing I do, making people okay. smile. You, using this character, I want to know how many people got connected with you. Okay. So, on my, on my actual Wally Fun with Lisa page, I've got, I think, 780 likes but I know definitely I've got more people that know know it because then people share my posts yeah, yeah. Yeah. and then I get yeah and so it just goes so they don't necessarily like my page but they do follow me because then I'll, I'll post it up on my normal page I do a little bit on Instagram but I'm too old for Instagram I can't get my head around Instagram I've got to do a bit more posting to get young people like you following me but uh um, yeah, I'm more of a Facebooker, and then I'm just known around my local area here as Where's Wally. So. Okay. So, do you wear this dress every day? No. No. <laughs> People think I do. People think I do because I post a lot up as Where's okay. Wally. But no, I don't. I'm going to be um, probably in the next week. I'll go and promote a couple of businesses. There's a vet who um, looks after animals that they need some funding. And some oh they're beeping again. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, my oh God. again! Oh, they're so excited that Wally's being interviewed. <laughs> I'm so glad. Man. Anyway, okay. sorry. Um, yeah, so they're needing some volunteers and people to you know give them some money and maybe volunteer their time. So I'll go and do a promotion for that. And then there's a, a zoo that's opened up here with a new owner. I might go and do a promotion for that. And um, yeah, so that's really what I do. Just go out promote yeah. things, and I volunteer my time. I don't pay charge for it. Everything's okay. free. It's only voluntary. I just do it. Okay. I like. So what what is the goal of your life? Goal of my life is oh. healthy. I want to stay healthy. I'm not money's not a big thing for me. Like it's nice to have money, but I don't believe you need to be rich to be happy. Um, and to make people smile. That's my goal in life. To make people smile. Super, super. 
Yeah. Yeah. Because and I always say to people, is it, hey, I, want, I want you to try this. Try frowning. Can okay. you frown? Go on, give me a frown. Do you frown? You know what frowning is, you know, pulling a grumpy face. Can you I, do that? <laughs> you know, like this. Yeah. You know, you go like that. Can you yeah, do yeah. that? Yeah. <laughs> so when you're not happy, you know, if when okay. you ask your girlfriend to marry you and then she says, no, you're going to be frowning. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, oh so no, you're laughing. You're not meant to be laughing. You're meant to be frowning. You know, so if you frown and you've got a furrowed, that's hard work. But try okay. smiling. How I'll easy try. is it to smile? I think uh, world needs people like you. I think so that uh, people, human, humans health will be very good and uh, they can kick. Uh, uh, COVID-19 and coronavirus so yeah, that they can so be healthy. Yeah. Turn your frown upside down, I say. Smile. Always okay. smile. <laughs> okay. If you smile, it makes you feel a lot better. Okay. I'll do that. <laughs> so thank yeah. you. Th thank you so much for uh, giving your valuable time and uh, telling no about uh, the character. What yep, is the no name problem. of the character? Where's Wally? Waze Wally, I, I really love the character and uh, you are wearing the dress and uh, spreading the happiness, you know, which is not a small thing. Uh, you know, every uh, every person from who, uh, who, who is watching uh, this video from different parts of the world, definitely they have to go through this book. And yep. because this is this is more about fun and you need to smile and you, you, your kids need to uh, get knowledge from that book at the same yeah. time uh, you, you, your wife your girlfriend and my girlfriend my kids <laughs> exactly right there we are we all, Wally will be, and every time you read the book you'll think of me and if yeah. you ever frown think how hard it is to frown and then smile and it's a lot easier to smile okay I'll try to be like you in coming videos definitely I'll I'll try to mention your name as, a, okay. as an inspiration. Thank, so, yeah. thank you. And if they want to follow me, it's Wally Fun with Lisa on Facebook and Instagram. And I'll try and do some more Instagram for the young ones. I look after the old ones at the moment because I'm old. 53 now I am. I'm an old awesome. girl. <laughs> yeah, you're yeah, awesome. Yeah, 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 extraordinary. You're making no. me smile. You know, this is this is not a small thing. Making other people to smile is not. A, you know small thing people we all human here living for this smile yeah people thank you are, very yeah, much people are, people are daily waking up in the morning doing different stuff going to different works only because of this smile and you're doing oh. that i think uh, this is this is one of the greatest jobs and that this is the only job human should do i think exactly smile everyone yeah. has the, everyone has the ability to smile it's one thing that we can all do but creating that smile is uh, is, a, is a great idea that yes, exactly. Yep, that and it doesn't cost you, doesn't cost you anything to smile. Anything, yeah. yeah. It's a free. It's free. So, so you go on the streets of the uh, Australia and uh, you make uh, people to connect yeah. with you and uh, you make them uh, laugh uh, by telling yeah. uh, your stuff. Yep, yeah, just yep. Yeah. And I always, I always, when um, you're gonna have to do this when you sign out for me as well. Okay. So when we sign out. Okay. You have to say signing out as Wally, and you go like this: thumbs up. You got to put your thumbs up, and you go okay. signing out as Wally. That's what you do. <laughs> Perfect. All you need is a, a beanie and a red and white striped shirt. You've got a job. Yeah. You'll make so, a cool okay. Wally. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You made me laugh today. Thank you so much. Can I put this uh, video, uh, recorded video, on my YouTube channel with your certainly permission? Certainly can. Yeah, certainly can. I'd love it. If anyone wants to follow me, Wally Fun with Lisa, or one word, Wally Fun with Lisa. Yeah, definitely. I'll share the, your link uh, in the description of this video so that people who watches this video will uh, follow you and uh, send you Perfect. messages and can connect with you. Yeah. Perfect. And I'll share you on my page as well and try and get you some more subscribers. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. If whenever you get time again, you know, I'll try to connect with you and we'll have uh, uh, more, okay. more, more fun. Yeah. Yeah. And tell your girlfriend I will and her in the video next time as well. I'd like to meet her. Yeah. I, I... <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. She watches okay. this video. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so okay. much. Okay. You have a great day. Yeah. You do. See ya. See you. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>